Hello, everyone. Hello. Hello. Oh my god, what time is it? It's way past our bedtime. It's too late. That's what the time is. I've made that joke it's before. Super late. <laughs> 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 it never gets old, don't worry. It no, never. never. <laughs> it's 10 p.m., everyone. You have to be a little bit easy on us because yeah. uh, we've Jesus. done a full day of work and now we're coming back because we just love them games so much. We just yeah. love content. <laughs> we do indeed. <laughs> <laughs> uh, seriously, though, I am genuinely fingers crossed for a longer look at Ragnarok and maybe like a gameplay demo of Horizons Forbidden West. That would be so can you imagine like the, the flags on that, that though? Like <laughs> just like, oh you thought you turned gonna turn out for a stream with like some teasers? No. Yeah, Here's no. a ten minute gameplay demo. That's pretty but... exciting. Oh wait, actually I've just realized that I've I've got you two the wrong way around in your little boxes. Let me just put you where I'm you're in supposed to be. Now. <laughs> hey, I'm sorry Bell, I'll tune in to my Twitch channel for some makeup <laughs> stuff later on. I'm gonna be making <laughs> myself look like an orc from world of warcraft it's gonna and be I'm Ian Higton, so that means i've got my terraflop series going on when i play terrifying old games for some reason oh, that's really awesome. scary. <laughs> see you come you come for the state of play you stay for the barbed comments <laughs> at each other <laughs> they, weren't barbed. they were that was a nice they were little loving, that was genuinely a tribute. They were, yeah. i know i wish i could i had the talent to make myself look like an orc from who's uh, stopping oh, ian ian we've seen warcraft. your costume your costume Costume talents are unparalleled, honestly. Yeah, they're definitely. Well, a costume, yeah, maybe, but makeup, I'm not too sure. <laughs> maybe we <laughs> could. Uh, I can teach you, Ian. I can do a good bad look on you at some point. <gasps> yes, definitely. Oh yeah, let's do I did do my own makeup for good bad, but it was literally three fingers in cam <laughs> in green paint, and then like ah, ah. that'll do. Incredible. That'll do. So anyway, guys, um, <laughs> we are here because, yeah, State of Play, I mean, it, it, this dropped, like, what, a day ago? Yesterday? Yeah, really recently. Yeah. And so you said literally, like, this week, oh, my God, I could really go for a new State of Play yes. right now. I need some new announcements. Well, <laughs> ask and you shall receive. I do, don't you... want to say I'm the puppet master Fantastic. of the games industry, but, like, <laughs> so, what can um, I say? Yeah, just but, check yeah, your it, rooms for bugs. Yeah, just absolutely. It's just like this year, I think, has already been quite quiet and it's quite quiet in the future. So to have this now is a big deal. Like yeah. this will give mm -hmm. us basically momentum for a, quite a while on what we can speculate about, what we can kind of do streams teasing yes. and like kind of exploring. Like it's exciting stuff, genuinely. We need some new announcements, please. That I've got an great. announcement. Thanks yeah. for the super chat, Blinks241. Yay! Oh, thank, thank you. you. They didn't say anything, but they did a super chat anyway. That's nice. Very sweet. Thank you. But yeah, so, so what are you both hoping for in uh, uh, the stream? So uh, this is pie in the sky, and this is like you know absolutely best. Like just, just, just wild. Like leave all of your you know your common sense at the door stuff. But I want to see Bloodborne to Elden Ring, yep. right? Ooh. Straight out the gate. Yeah, straight out the gate. Okay. I will. I will lose my proverbial SH1T if that happens. Like <laughs> seriously. <laughs> Elden Ring. They've been keeping us waiting for so long with information about it. So long, like. If it, if we don't hear Enjoy about it sometime time. soon, I I I'm not sure it's gonna happen at all. To be honest with you. Yeah, no, that's fair enough. Oh, Olivia Connell, thank you for your super chat. Oh, thank, thank you. you. Kay about... Marshall did one as well. Yeah. So, Zoe and Ian swap channels for a day. Make it oh, so. Yeah. That would be amazing. I <laughs> imagine. Oh my god. <laughs> Okay, um, so Ian, what are you predicting? Because we, I, I think Zoe, care. we need to end on you because you're the you're the act, you actually have a chance of seeing what you're what you're going to want to see. Yeah. <laughs> we don't want to get too high yeah. hopes or everything yeah. else, but yeah. Sorry, Ian, yeah. what are you saying? No, I don't care. I'm not bothered. I don't give a shit. <laughs> whatever you can put whatever they want up. I'm still reeling about PlayStation VR two news. Oh yeah. Um, that's all we care about now. Screw screw flat games. Screw you flat games. <laughs> what was the announcement? Just that it's happening? Just that it's happening, yeah. Did we After that anyway? No, we didn't know. Oh, there's okay. been there's been some leaks like maybe tech specs and stuff, but there's nothing concrete. They'd never given us a, a proper official announcement. So, Ooh. you know, it, and it, it's been such a long time since they'd done any focus on PlayStation VR mm. that a lot of people, myself included, were kind of like Oh, is this going to go the way of the Vita? Are they going to just quietly, you know, put it out to pasture? But uh, no, there's going to be a new PlayStation Ooh. 2. They said um, brand new technology, um, simpler cable management, different controllers, 
Um, the dev kits are going out now. So, yeah, super excited Whoa. about that. I'd love to hear some more in this show. I don't know whether we will, but do that's... You know that- do you know that I'm meme? Do you know that meme that's I don't understand any of this, but I support you? That's <laughs> that's, that's me right now for you, and I'm, I'm happy yeah. that you're happy. Awesome. <laughs> okay, that's Zoe, tell us tell us everything that you want to see. Okay, five points for anyone who can guess the two games I'm going to mention right now. But number one, God of War Ragnarok. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, we got that like very brief teaser last time, where it's so brief. The, yeah, very brief. Like the the your Mangander is was like in the teaser we saw we saw that it was snowy so it's obviously ragnarok is happening mm-hmm. i would like to see like maybe a tiny bit of gameplay in the form of a trailer i think it's probably still in the really early stages um so maybe 2023 but i would love to see something from Ooh. that because i always think when don't you think when game studios show teasers like that it's like yeah but I yeah mean, but yeah that's like a title screen that's yeah, nothing yeah, yeah, it's yeah, not yeah. anything else yeah absolutely um, but I think we're much more likely to see a glimpse of Horizon Forbidden West, maybe like a five minute, 10 minute, like trailer Ooh. or like a mm-hmm. gameplay trailer, because I think it's supposed to come out this year, isn't it? I yes, it was. It was 2021, oh, I think. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, so I feel like, we'll see, but yeah, I feel like now is the time when they want to start hyping it up and they want to start getting it in people's minds that it's a game they want to buy. Mm-hmm. Um, so something it's like that. that. Part I... of the part of the PR cycle, you know, we're at that it point is. now. <laughs> it really is. But yeah, I just like, but I'm also excited to see what else they're going to come up with because honestly, like, what else does Sony have at the moment? Uh, like, in well, terms of games coming. They've got Project Aria, right? That's coming I was, I was about to say, like, isn't that, but that's the Final Fantasy game, right? Because I was going to say Final Fantasy, the next one, mm. is probably something that, that that has a chance of being shown. Yes, yeah. But have we, has it been confirmed that Project Aria is Final Fantasy? No, I think I just assumed it was. It's your fan <laughs> It's your theory that it is. If it was, that would be amazing. <laughs> But yeah, and Stray also. I'm looking forward to seeing oh, some Stray. Oh, that's all the cat, isn't it? No, I'll cry. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, hey. And the Bridge of Spirits 2 is going to be a thing. Um, okay. It's just like, I feel like we'll probably get some more third party titles yes. drops, don't you think? I think they did say that as well. I think they said like some of the indie games that were, um, they said basically some of the games that we saw, that we last saw at the June showcase, well, we're getting a deeper dive on them today. And then we're cool. also perhaps getting some new new things as well thrown in the mix. Sweet. So. I don't know. I think I think like from from the last few state of plays. I mean, maybe my memory's hazy now, but I feel like Sony have kind of gotten what people expect. Like they know how to manage people's expectations now. So yeah. I'm hoping like the fact that they're not saying anything at all makes me kind of hopeful that it's that it's going to be kind of exciting. But yeah. Mm-hmm. I feel like if they've got, if they've stayed that type of about it, because they're so good at like, well, like you mentioned, for like managing people's expectations, mm-hmm. like they don't want us to go and think it's going to be all AAA stuff. So with last time, they were quite obvious about third party title mm-hmm, things. Mm-hmm. But um, yeah, maybe they're going hard. How do we, do we know how long it's going to be? Because I guess that'll give some indication about how much they're going to show. About a half an hour, give or take, I think they said. Okay. Mm. I guess that's not long enough for super long gameplay looks, but definitely Depends, long yeah. enough for... Game Maybe a bit trailers. more Resi 8 as well, maybe? Ooh, yeah, yeah, that's possible, yeah, for sure. Maybe. Although I feel like we've seen... Well, no, it's coming out in May. There's still some time, so... Mm. That's mm. true. Mm. Well, considering what big of a success Lady Dimitriscu has been, maybe they give us some kind of, like, <laughs> yeah. like nod to her or something. I will to be like, oh, what if they release a statue you could buy of her? Because the statue at the moment that comes with the uh, deluxe edition they isn't that Chris Redfield. They would be wild not to, not yeah. to do Lady lady d merch like let's be honest to do it like, didn't on. you make a lady d body pillow already that's <laughs> yes, that, I did. that's yes, gonna I sell did. a lot that is gonna sell a lot I'm check sure. out that video guys because it's just incredible <laughs> 20 <laughs> video game characters that made us thirsty it's on the channel right now <laughs> yes um we've missed quite a few super chats um we have you i've got back I've, up? Yeah, I've held on to them. Uh, Blinks241 is back and says, lol, I didn't put my first message. Greetings from Australia. First Yay! live stream. Love the whole Gamer Network team. Thanks, Aww. Blinks. Aww, Des thank Randall you. says, with the lockdown, UK lockdown being eased, do you think we might get some break f- uh, <laughs> break <laughs> quest clubs sometime soon? Um, I think... We, we can't wait to do it, but yeah. it's got to be safe for everyone. Like, mm-hmm. um, It's a long trip for some of us. UK and we don't lockdown take... is never-ending, basically. Yeah. <laughs> Once we've it's... had vaccines and stuff, and we, we, you know, we're we confident we're not bringing stuff back home to people and things. Yes. You know, it's it's it six people it. in a very small room <laughs> yep. for multiple hours. Like, mm. Just bear that in mind. So it definitely has to be proper safe. And I think almost all of us live in different parts of the country. So Yeah, yeah. 
Yeah, we'll see. Um, but yeah. we can't wait. Yes, we really uh, want to absolutely. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. yeah, definitely. definitely. Um, we've also got one from Amy Lee that says, at work, can't wait to watch this later. Say hi to my mm. husband, Brian, who gets to watch it now. Hi, hi Brian. Thank you, Brian. <laughs> Thanks for joining us. Um, and I think we have another one, yes, from uh, scrolling from <laughs> Ranjita that says, "Yay, catching you live! Thanks a million for the lovely company." By the Aww. way, didn't think Ian would become my fave, but now I love shenanigans. Shenanigans! Oh, shenanigans. I, I am That's a big fan thing. of shenanigans. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. You can always um, count on chaos when Ian's around. Um, we had a, sub, a couple more uh, just uh, pop in there. Um, uh -huh. We have one from uh, DCC zero two zero nine that says. Is there a Sony property from the PS2, PS3 era like Motorstorm or Sly Cooper you would want to see revived? I haven't played I either of those. Motorstorm would be a good one. I've never played Sly Cooper, but I was a big fan of Motorstorm back in the day. Okay. A good new Motorstorm would be pretty exciting. Yeah. Um, Is Motorstorm hmm. that one where you're trying to kill each other with cars? Is that? No, that's um, the Twisted Metal. Oh, yeah. Motorstorm's kind of like like racing but through earthquakes and Ooh. tsunamis and things like that it's very very cool lots of explosions Amazing. and driving around lava flows and things mm. sweet <clears throat> uh danny shields has done a super chat saying everybody wants to get that vitamin lady d <laughs> yeah, they do. <laughs> take one and call me in the morning well to be honest yeah. everyone should be taking their vitamin c now especially if you're in quarantine and lockdown because yes. you're not mm. getting enough vitamin d from the sunlight right now so uh take a wee vitamin d supplement and stay healthy everyone. Oh. Oh God, maybe that's why I'm. Maybe that's why I'm uh, constantly tired. It'll keep your skin and hair nice and healthy. Um, we have a super chat from Roswell Walton that says, unrelated to this, but a certain sea dad is very happy you're all getting into Sea of Thieves. Hey. <laughs> what a surprise! I know. Well, I'm sure he. Like I told Johnny, I would never go back to Sea of Thieves, but uh, <laughs> never say never. Here we are. Here we are. Here we are. And uh, we have a super chat from Stephen Scodes. It says, "Hello hey, everyone. Hope all is lovely well." Lovely Stephen. Aww, Hello, thank Stephen. You, Stephen. And an another super chat from another Stephen, Stephen Donovan, that says, Elden Ring, Elden Ring. Uh, <laughs> Kina for PS Plus? Kina? Kina yeah, that's Ring. Kina, the Bridge of the Spirits. It's oh. the one that looks kind of like Kubo on the two strings in its style. Oh. oh. Was, um, yeah, it was like with tiny soot sprites kind of. That cool. Oh, yes, 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 yes. 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 And uh, It's a Moi says, uh, can I get a happy birthday? Thank you and love you all. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. Thank, you for, birthday. thank you for joining us on your birthday. Right, well, yes. there's less than a minute to go before we start, what? so have your sips of water. And I'm hydrating now because <laughs> we're going to be doing a lot of talking. Because we need to, we need to be flourished and... And, uh, and healthy for all this news that's hopefully ah. gonna come rolling in right about now. I want mm -hmm. to eat all of these things on the screen right now. They I want to eat the like, little tubes. Although they we're, look we're, like we're, they'd really hurt if you stood on them in your bare feet. Yeah, oh, actually. Mm. That's fair. What would they taste like? Like, you know those sweets you get in Japan, they're like sugar sweets that yes. say, like, like stars? Them. They taste oh, like Yeah, them. definitely. That's yeah. I've decided. Yeah. Like yeah, the ones no, we had in our t taste test video because they weren't yep, so good. Correct. Mm -hmm. Oh god. Here we go. Yeah. <gasps> One. Beep. Okay, show us the good things, please. Imagine if they start with God of War or something. Oh, that would be great. Oh, it's a no. Heads off just in case. <laughs> oh, oh it's the PlayStation. Spider Man? Oh, no. <laughs> it looked a little bit like a Spider Man Lego for a second. Oh, this is, um, is this Ratchet and Clank? No. no. Crash. Crash, yeah. Woo. <laughs> that last part might have been a hair dramatic. But there's lots of awesome updates and additions coming. I am Bandicoot so bad at Crash Bandicoot. Bandicoot. It's a joke. It's really hard. Con Very considering hard. it's about a ginger that wears jorts, you'd think I'd like Crash Bandicoot, <laughs> but um, I've never really been that into it. It's biographical. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it is biographical, yeah. I mean, the amount of times I've jumped on top of a hippo's head. <laughs> <laughs> so they're starting off with just DLC. Starting off slow. Uh, yeah, I think so. Nice. Okay, and um, if anyone is has any issues with our audio, let me know. I've seen that some people said it was a bit quiet, so I boosted it. Uh, but yes. Crash that bandicoot. I just crash it. It's so hard. I I've only ever played like the you know the uh, remastered version yeah. that came out not that long ago. Yeah. So I read somewhere that the platforms in the remastered one were shaped like lozenges rather than flat, which is why kind of people had an issue with like not grasping the edges of them when they jumped. Why were they and made I tried like that? It. I don't know. I tried it once or twice and I just couldn't, couldn't get along with it. At all. 
So you can feel the blast Please. of Neocortex's beam. Yeah, I played it back in the day. Actually, yeah. Ethan, we played it blindfolded at that time. Do you remember when we did that? We did that event um, in the London Dungeons oh, thing. Yeah. Oh, they say uh, the volume still needs to be higher. Oh, okay. All right, I'll crank yeah. it some more. Well, what are you all doing now? Josh Perini has done a super chat saying, Sitting in a closet wiring a network rack with new cables. It's possibly the most boring part of my job right now. So glad this video came up to make my day so much more entertaining. Thanks, you lovely people. Thank you, Josh Perini. Thank you. Leverage PlayStation 5 activity cards to track your progress. I'll be honest with you, I've never looked like at any of the activity trials. cards on my PS5. Flashback no, levels, me neither. Boss fights. No, me they just kind of what my uh, controller rests on when I'm trying to do Even something off screen. I'm like, don't go to sleep though, please. Don't go to sleep. I just keep on the card for a little bit. To get to I've, uh, I've ducked my audio a bit because oh, people were saying I was a bit loud. That doesn't sound like you. What? Me being loud? I'm not just loud. Never. Whether it's your first playthrough okay. or your hundredth, there's I do no love the environment. Time it's so it is lovely and colorful. Yeah. It's about time lovely. on PlayStation Ian, that 5. Is you. Like, like you are yeah. Crash Bandicoot. Hundred <laughs> <laughs> percent. Welcome back, Crash. The gang's all here yeah, yeah. on today's new edition of State of Play. Yeah. We've got some great up yeah. lined up for you. First, let's check out the latest on an eagerly anticipated Ooh, game coming to the PS5 I am actually console for this spring from PlayStation Studios. Yeah, this looks cool. Why does it look yeah. like she's standing, hey standing in front we of the giant Housemark bubble wrap? excited to give you this <laughs> <laughs> one. Oh, oh, it. Return. That would be amazing. In return, <laughs> you will play as Selene, an Astra Scout, who crash lands on an alien planet, Atropos, after receiving a mysterious <gasps> signal, White Shadow. Ooh. Players will explore this inscrutable oh, wow, cool. planet and search for answers to uh, so. unfold mysteries, which may point to a larger force. It's the play. mysteries that I'm interested in. Ooh. I want to know what the hell went on here. Dashing oh, awesome! That's your way very control-esque, isn't it? Is key to survival in return. Whoa, those enemies are amazing. Yeah, great tentacle physics. <laughs> Oh god. <laughs> it's kind of like a roguelite, isn't it? You die and you come back, you die and you come back. Oh, is right. it? Yeah, mm, I, I think so. so yeah. Every time the world's changed. Well, I, d were they just With like the creating craters in the grind there? The vast number of unique Maybe? Sets each possess. Combat situations oh, prove god. challenging. That no looks matter intense. What it's hectic. Mm. Yeah. Death is only the beginning. Oh, yeah. Yeah. There we go. Oh my god, is this going to be like Dark Souls in space? Oh. Every yes, please. When you, die and restart, well, you don't know you want something until someone says it. The map will be <laughs> Enemies will appear in new locations and in differing numbers. <laughs> so you have to think fast and adapt. The environment. Here you can yeah, see the it kind of feels a little bit fire, like. Which is great for crowd control. This a is tiny bit like Risk of Rain, a little bit. Like the world just changes every single time you die. Yeah. Although Risk of Rain, you have maps that you can depend on, but yeah. Oh, wow. This looks cool, though. I love all the colors. Yeah. I wonder how you they're going to progress the story when each world keeps changing every time you die. To the yeah, have weapons, maybe like markers or something? And upgrades, and yeah. Completely change your play like there's got to be, I wonder how the checkpoint system is going to work. Yeah. Besides the intense combat, Returnal also has a deep and engaging narrative. We allow players we to go. piece together the puzzle that is the story of Selene. As they venture deeper and deeper into Atropos and into her Oh, that creepy house. Yeah. What? That's a that can't bit be bizarre. Here. Maybe they'll have um, like dead every space? time you, yeah, like fully. maybe a certain number of times you die that will be corroded. when the narrative kicks in. Yeah. So oh, that's awesome. Mm. Oh, it's like the um, the Red Dwarf it. episode, Rimmer World, where parts of her personality start terraforming the, the planet. Thank you for the super chat, Benedict. Uh, XBL Dawn, you guys rock. Saving the day. No oh, Xbox Live is down. Oh, no. No. oh first person. Hello. <gasps> Holy shit. Space PT. Yes, please. <laughs> Absolutely. Do you think that was a cutscene, or do you reckon it sometimes goes into first person? I would that, love it. I would, that would be amazing. Went. That would be so cool. It would be such a cool way to mix it up as well. Like all these super intense moments Returnal when you're fighting for your life, and then you have really quiet moments yeah. where you're like, the team at House yeah. that really lets like the psychological horror bits. Next, let's take a closer yeah. look at a high impact mm. new PS4 oh, look, Ian, game you know this one. Knockout yeah. City. Yay, Knockout yeah. City! It's actually quite good fun. Um, mm -hmm. 
Judging what by the views on the video, not many people can. No. <laughs> Check out the video if, you, if you're I'm, interested I'm in this game because Studios. Ian's seen quite We're a bit an of this. Developer based in yeah, New I played a couple of hours of it. It's good yeah. fun. Like it has kind of like Splatoon vibes almost to it. Yeah, um, I could imagine Rockout it City is easy to pick up like it's on a knife edge of like being completely guess. forgotten or being something that everyone suddenly head head picks up and starts playing. Kind of like yeah, 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 and yeah, yeah. like the ta a well -timed catch when you get the tactics the down and the, the curves of the balls and stuff, it feels really satisfying. Mm. Mm. Trick shots to lob a ball over a I mean, it looks quite polished, doesn't it? Yeah. It's quite Fake poppy, which is quite pleasing. Mm. It's kind of like dodgeball, almost. Yeah, ball. Yeah. Ball yeah. That's yeah. really adorable. No, yeah, it's, it is. Well. They, they, they call it dodge ball. Oh. Oh. <laughs> there we go. Yeah. 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 If your crew is outmatched, a well no, team it's, too, it's all against all. Yeah, so one of the moves you a new can do is find called a ball up move, data. where you the turn into a ball. And yeah. then your teammates <laughs> can pick you up and throw you at the enemy. Oh, that's amazing. You can take them out the your enemy can pick you up and then throw you off the, the map if you're not careful. Each map features a unique mechanic. In back alley brawl, you can hop into a tube and make a quick getaway or use them to sneak up on your opponents. Boff! Caught nice. empty-handed. Uh, it does, it does look very pleasing. Like, yeah. Very kind of like, oh, just one more, just one more. Yeah. It's just got a very confident kind of art style well, with all these graphics mm -hmm. and stuff as well. Launch them high yeah. into the air with I think if you had a, a team of friends that were well into it with you, mm. you'd get proper good like learning like all the, the tactics and so the tricks of the world over the last four years. Yeah, it's going to be one of those games that live or die on whether the community actually picks it up or not, really. hundred percent, hundred percent. crew and sign up for our crossplay beta at knockoutcity.com to play early on PlayStation. Yeah, there's been kind of a spate of games like that. I think, what is it, Battleborn closed their servers oh, like, yeah. last year, right? And then yeah. uh, Bleeding Edge. Anthem closed the one their from... servers today as well, I think. Yeah, Anthem did Bleeding Edge. Like, it definitely feels like now in the multiplayer kind of landscape, it's much more, time for if it's not working new. within a certain time frame, Here's we're not going to spoil it anymore. Time, like, yeah. 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 Which is kind of a shame, really. But... A lot to risk, yeah, yeah. definitely. Oh. Oh. Slow clap. What the fuck is this? I'm into this already. <laughs> <laughs> WTF? Good flex. Oh, is it a fighting game? Yeah, it looks like a, like a fighting game. A yeah. um, corridor brawl or something. Oh, oh, it like looks like the boy. corridor brawl from Old Boy, yeah. <laughs> Get that fucking hammer out. No, it actually it is. Yeah. Holy crap. This looks fucking awesome. Is it like a never ending corridor? Corridor, yeah. I can't never end in Corridor of Beats. I play that game. <gasps> oh. I passed up for so long he grew a beard. <laughs> <laughs> I was supposed to have one hell of a hit. Oh no, we're not we're not oh. in a corridor anymore. This is just this is literally a beat em up. You yeah. see people, you beat em up. John Wick style just smash <gasps> their head and Whatever that was was fucking cool. <gasps> Oh my god! Sifu. Is this like a really That's... visceral hand-to-hand -hand combat? Yeah. yeah, like the raid yeah. or something. Mm -hmm. That oh, was the debut the so of much. Sifu coming to the PS5 console <laughs> later this year. <laughs> Spooky socialist just went. I know. I know. An epic new PS5 adventure from Heart Machine. Ooh. So this and is the, the like the indie really game section of the presentation, I guess. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Annapurna very rarely go wrong. Like they are. Yeah. Of anything with Annapurna, like behind it, gets my interest immediately. Just instant trust, isn't it? Mm. Hey everyone, I'm Alex Ooh. Preston, hey, Alex. creative director of Art Machine. You might know us as the team behind Hyperlight Drifter. Today, I'm that's here it. Hyperlight Drifter. I was trying to think. For our the color scheme's very Solar similar. Ash. Yes. Yeah. Solar Ash is a huge, stylish 3D platformer Ooh. focused on speed, Ooh. movement, and fluidity. The game is set inside a giant black hole known as the Ultra Boy, which has been consuming the Ultra Boy. Ultra Boy. <laughs> oh, the good boy. That is the Boy Ultra Boy. <laughs> 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 yeah. into this as a oh. last-ditch effort to save her homeworld. Oh, we've seen. I think we've seen this was announced agile, in the last state of play, wasn't it? Yeah, I think so. Skating. On the ashen clouds, she can quickly cover great distances in our huge world. 
At its core, this looks like Solar it's really reminding me of another kind of similar game and about speed and kind of parkour. I cannot believe it's called. Cool. Not sure. It looks there was, um, yeah, it's bring it, like there was a game recently that came out where you skid on your knees and you fire arrows. I can't oh remember yeah. Oh the um the fa Falcon Falconeer. Mm. Yeah, yeah. It looks like a face -face little bit like that. And violent creatures. Which I think was some of the people simple, involved in Journey, which is kind of the movement ah. is kind of similar in this as well. Fun. A little bit. Interesting. As you explore the ultra, it certainly looks super smooth. Mm. Like, mm. It kind of needs to be, I guess. It's really? like the movement is absolutely. These creatures yeah. require speed and precise timing to defeat. Ooh. Ooh. Yes. Yeah, what was the pathless? Maybe you were thinking of Nightcat says yes. Uh, the pathless all over the again. Path. Ah. Will eventually yes, need to that's face the one. massive sentinels oh. of this void, wretched, starved dragon beasts friend. that hold the key Bony to the dragon quest. friend. Bony dragon friend. There's sea monsters like that in Valheim. Oh god! I can't. <laughs> the first time we see one of those, I will lose my shit. Like we were sailing, we were sailing on the ocean today, and uh, for a second, our boat suddenly like. Had something broken off of it in the middle of the ocean. Oh, we were like, uh, the sorry. <laughs> the giant spaces, the feel of movement, the flow of combat, I love how she looks. and the high I love stakes her battles. Mm -hmm. It's beautiful. Their cloak, I guess. All yeah. come together to bring players something we think is incredibly unique and, more importantly, fun. This game is a labor of love for everyone on the Heart Machine team. Yeah. We're excited to bring Solar Ash to PS5 and PS4 later this year. So incredibly yeah. stylized. Mm. Pew, pew. Sweet. Oh. If you're a fan of scary I games, I am a fan of scary games. Yes, please. More Resi? No. Nope. Oh my. You were oh. Don't like or it. Small. Don't want it. No thanks. <laughs> Okay, ease up, friend. Are you ready? Ooh, no. Ooh, no. is this a new Five Nights at Freddy's what game? I think nope. it's the new Five Nights. What? Maybe. Yeah, really? is this the security breach one? Yeah. It totally is. What the fuck was that thing? <laughs> oh my gosh, it actually is. Oh my. What? It's a laser quest kind of thing. I mean. Yeah. They've really upped their uh, their budget, eh? Like this is mm. this looks quite fancy. Oh, I hate this. No. Oh, I'm so tense right now. Chica. I hate animatronics. <laughs> no, no jump scares. No jump scares. Thanks. Oh, God. We can get you out of here. You and me together. Ooh, maybe it's co-op. Story. Is it story now? Yeah, it might be. Maybe story co-op horror. I'm, I'm up for that. That sounds. They won't that sounds stop hunting you. None oh. of them. I mean, stop don't hunting. get me wrong. This sounds like great fun to play on Eurogamer when I can take a fucking break. <laughs> can you imagine the jump scares though? Oh, Ooh. oh we no! Have to get you out by morning. Yeah, it's like it's, it's like a whole fun house. Oh, yeah, it's an entire world. Fuck that! Just I say, you will bring me what I want, and if you fail, <laughs> thank you. Oh, don't mind that! Don't mind that! Fuck off! The one thing I would say oh, though is I hope they don't overuse them because I think mm. the real uh, I think the real success of of Five Nights at Freddy's is that if you see them, you're probably already dead. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. How are they going to make it work with the kind of actual scares? Mm, I don't because really want them chasing after you. Like, ooh, if like, you see a monster for too long, it's not scary anymore. Exactly. Yeah. Like, that yeah okay. I know what you look like. You're right. With Five Nights at Freddy's, it was the immediacy that made it so mm. terrifying. Mm. That's why Mr. X was so scary in oh, Resi next. 2 because you knew he was yes. there, but he wasn't Soul always story. there. Yeah. So you knew he was about to turn up. But they didn't overuse it. Hi, I'm Lauren Lanning, creative director at Odd. I mean, it looks like a really good horror story. Today, I'm going to take yeah, you on for a sure. tour of our newest game, Oddworld Soulstorm. They've always known. They've always showed you it comes. In Soulstorm, you, play it? you, you reprise played the role of Odd World games. I've played a couple, yeah. Unlikely leader they good? of an emerging revolution. Yeah, they're great. Yeah, As really you do battle the original is like a wonderful um, environment, a proper and classic kind of platform the puzzle. And, and then I played Abe's weapons. Odyssey, which is a little bit different. Um, we really wanted to bring this world to life with what well, this we looks call great. This looks like it's platforming. 
We Thoroughly inspired by the first game, the original PlayStation played, 1 game. But yeah, I this played that for um, later this party a little bit. Yeah. And it's really hard. It's really, really yeah, hard. Yeah, it is. What well, makes it hard? It's, like, it's very unforgiving. Like, the yeah. like, if you make a wrong move, like, it's kind of like trial and error gameplay. If you, if you, if you well die, you, like, you know, fellow you're straight back to the start again. But, Zoe, it does have a dedicated fart button. Oh, excellent. Well, what more would you need, really? You'll be able to solve puzzles, harness their combined Hopefully they bring that back and be given to this the tools one. they need to fight alongside you. Otherwise, yeah. it's and there not, will be times when the extra like hands will be needed on. as you face yeah. off against an array of heavily armed enemies. I just that will find stop I find the art style of these an games kind all. of uninteresting. Like it's all very brown and rusty mm. looking, and I don't have a chance against this much larger. Yeah. Yeah. Feels a bit Borderlands One, Monkey Odyssey to the West, first range, doesn't it? Like to craft an impressive personal design. Yes. Yes. Yeah, totally. Uh, Which kind of just turns me off because it's like I don't. I find it very like homogenized. Like I don't really visual. know where I'm supposed to look. And but there is one yeah. iconic yeah. ability. Right. Right. Lovely shade of grey green brown. <laughs> I think <laughs> we've kind of entered like the phase of gaming where people realise that stylization is actually really core cool to the game that you're trying to sell. And not this. They haven't thought about it with this game, but I mean, like I think there's a lot more risks being taken with the kind of games created and how they look. Yeah. That require yeah. a little more this is definitely a love letter to the original one. You'll find oh, yeah? dark and dangerous yeah. caves, heavily guarded it's industrial sites, and so much of it looks lands. similar. Yeah. Here we've built lots of opportunities for you to test Brine your skills time. and find different I'm ways just, to I'm just going to openly admit that I'm selfish enough to genuinely not easy. care about escorting people in games. By I want to say me and me alone. Me and only me, except if there's like a cute animal. In which case I'll die for them. Trials against swarming dark creatures and industrial I once uh, I once interviewed Neil Druckmann for uh, Ultimately, The Last of Us oh, yeah? and uh, he told me that originally Ellie was going to be a dog to discover in, a in the very first really? yeah. and we've been able to that, bring you can see that interview like never oh my god in true odd world fashion what a different series that would have been yeah it would have been basically along the way and we can't wait to see what you will do oh I am legend oh I am legend yeah Interesting. Jeez. Oh, why do those eyes look pretty weird to me? Oh, Stranger's Wrath. I played Stranger's Wrath as well. Yeah, you're oh. right, Gavin. That's a good one. That was, that's a spin-off that's in um, first person. Stranger's that was Wrath. the latest on yeah, Oddworld Soulstorm. And here's some exciting news. Active PlayStation Plus members will get the PS5 version for no extra cost nice. starting in April. PS5 yeah, it's version for exciting. no extra cost yeah, starting so. in April. Oh. Mm. If you want to. Oh. Yeah. Moving on. Look, this is it. Time to catch Kena. up with Kina, Bridge of Spirits. Uh, Look at Kina. Gorgeous new adventure we last saw on the Genie TV Showcase. Yee, it's got a little hat. <laughs> you can definitely get change your hats with them, right? Surely. <gasps> oh, I love it. Oh, oh I love it. <laughs> <laughs> That's the highest I've ever heard you go. <laughs> he's so pudgy. Oh, he's so pudgy. Oh. <laughs> It's gonna eat her. No, yes. <laughs> it's gonna go bite her face. Oh off. come on, that's too cute not to have an edgy side to it. Surely. If it turns into something like toothless, fine. But uh, yeah, I love right. toothless. Oh, there's loads of them. Look at that. Oh my god. So many. Something. I love her outfit. She's really. Cool. I want. I want to poke them in their little tums. <laughs> Oh, Hello, is that the merchandising department? <laughs> Get me the plushies! <laughs> All the plushies! Yes. All the plushies! The shrines energy. But that power <gasps> Interesting. This looks beautiful. Yeah, it's got it lovely, does. lovely, wholesome adventure game vibes. It's like a DreamWorks film. Mm. Bad evil bad. Oh, cool. I was wondering whether it was just puzzles where they actually did have combat in it. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Winter Forest says, Mom, I want one now! <laughs> James Franklin says, Insert Rosa Diaz's I've only known X for a day and a half. <laughs> 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 This looks alright. This is yeah. good. 
I mean, we haven't really... I feel like we're seeing a lot of cutscenes rather than actual gameplay, but... The gameplay looks... Yeah. 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 Ooh, that's... I love a good yeah. slow-mo bow and arrow action. You two should, um... Check out uh, Phoenix oh. Immortal Rising. If oh, you yeah. Oh, yeah. It's quite good. Um, and it's got a very bright, colourful art style like this. Yeah, I played the demo for that and I just felt like oh, not touched too much on Breath of the Wild, just like a bit. It is a Breath of the Wild light for sure. Yeah. I, it was a very good Christmas game. I enjoyed it over Christmas. <gasps> cute. Ooh. Foxy Lady. <laughs> oh. What? Oh, God. Oh my. Nana! That's awful. What, what oh. the hell? Crikey. Okay, now this is the edge we were missing in the yes. beginning. Yes. There we go. So, you want to free people from inside? Yeah, maybe. Okay, oh. my curiosity oh. is peaked. Yeah, I didn't really care before, but I'm definitely keener now. Yeah, oh, Ian! Oh, Ian! <laughs> so we like just stepped definitely. right under your radar. <laughs> First-person shooter developed by the team. Why at didn't you? D why could you just let me stay in ignorance oh. there? I don't know. Oh, more death loop! I'm so interested. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just you. Yeah. Every time I see this, it's like <laughs> can't wait. Bring it, baby. It is so <laughs> fucking stylish. I love it. Mm, it really is. This is Ramblin' Frank's matinee. This little ditty goes out to the handsome asshole trying to break our loop. Cold. The visionaries are ready to I'd be dance. happy of being called are a handsome you? asshole. Yeah. <laughs> yes. This is a, I'm very into this. Like, each time they show this game off, it's something completely different. Yeah. Like, oh, it's just such a treat for the face and eyes. <laughs> Mainly the eyes. Oh, I'm it. it kind of like, well. it reminds me of like part We Happy Few, part Dishonored. Mm. Like, yeah, like yeah. Kind of blend. That's a really and good I'm description. Really interested, yeah, I'm really interested to see how she's going to work. Like, is that a player? Is that AI? Like, what is she exactly? Mm. I love the 60s aesthetic. Like, I can't really think of many games that have had that sort of 60s vibe about them. Oh, it's so cool. You know there are going to be some amazing videos on the internet about people killing people in really intricate ways. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's definitely. going to be so good. This is a good song. Definitely. Not as good as yeah, not as good as the Buck Snack song, but oh, God. still, uh -huh. it's like a proper theme tune, isn't it? Ooh. Yeah. Like Bond. It is, um, yeah. Thank you for Super Chat, Danny Shields. Give me God of War, please! Yes! Kind of bug and kind of snacks. Ooh, it's very... You're, you're totally oh, spot on, Zoe. It is like a, like an actual cross between uh, Dishonored and We Have a Game. Somebody's still in fight. God, this looks so satisfying, though. Like, yeah, we... Just it's going to be like... So yeah, it looks like it's going to be like Hitman, where you... Just replay each level, yeah. just to find yeah. better routes through. And but like, and it, I'm really interested in the story as well. Like, why would there be someone trying to stop you from breaking a death loop, and why do they like being in one? You know, yeah. like, surely you get. Well, they're like to like kill themselves over and over again. You know? Yeah. Mm. Boy, I know. I should find out. Yeah. Let's do it again tomorrow. What to do when the poison is the same, but the kill is always new. There's only five so minutes left of this already. So what? what? The rest yeah. of you motherfuckers are next. Oh, it's sorry. so like, it's so well, enigmatic. Well, well. It's going to be so cool. Mm. Oh, I love it. Yeah, I'm so excited for Deathloop. It when is it coming so out? Good. Do you know? Uh, I... Mm. Don't. Before we how leave, about, what? how about a huge update for one of 2020's oh. most celebrated games? Box snacks. No, please no. Oh! Ah! Ooh. Oh shit! Hey, ah! son. <laughs> oh. Is it gonna? It's not gonna be part two. If it's just a PS5 update, like yay! But like fix those damn textures. <laughs> yep. Come on, let's oh, let's we're it's not, is it? It's a PS5 update. It must be. It doesn't look 
is it different though? This could be like footage from the, the PS4 game. Mm. A touching reunion. <laughs> Bye! Oh, just kiss. Well, guys, the girl oh. finally made it to Midgard. We Jesse. <sighs> What's this? I don't remember this. What's this? Oh, wait. Oh my god, Jeffy! My name is Yuffie! <laughs> 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 oh my god, it's hot! Oh my god, it's hot! Oh my god, We got this! I'm back. Holy ah, shit! There you are. Someone's been expecting you. What took you? Oh Sorry my about that. god. Oh my god. Anyway, it's nice oh to my god, what? I'm Sonon Kasakabe. Where's Cloud? We lost him. You what? He will be okay though, right? Well, of course he will. They're the ones who blew up the reactors. No, it's not who I thought it was. Should we say hi? No, better not. After what they've done. That's, no, that's not. Is it? It's team. not. Look, I'm just saying Toph. <laughs> yeah, that's not Toph, is it? <laughs> you call, you call, call her Toph. Yeah, that's, that is. That's Yuffie, yeah. Yeah, the subtitle oh. says Yuffie, and then maybe the other one. Yes, Yuffie. I mean Toph. <gasps> oh, she's a total babe. I love her. But I this is amazing. Zach, but it's not Zack. But it looks like Zack a lot. So is this not the part two? This is something this is this like, this extra is, stuff? Yeah. No, I think this is them seeding Wutai as like a kind of actual nation that exists before you meet them in the game. Right, okay. Because didn't they do some foreshadowing to that in the first part? Massively, yeah. Massively. Yeah. Oh, yes! Oh, look at her! Oh, he still is on my fucking Whatever shit, but I love her so much. They deserve what's coming to them. Yeah, they do, but I'm not your sister. There you are. Who are oh, these I love jerks? Her. No clue. It just appeared. But these jerks integrate. Oh my god, integrate. here, you see, now I, mm, no. this is where. Oh. Let the hunt begin. Ugh. So they're adding Did on. Did they make a word up? What yeah, was that? they, they, that's not the first time they've done this. That was <laughs> yeah. that was confirmation that they're adding in stuff from uh, the PSP. Well, they they've already kind of done oh. it, but uh, there's a PSP prequel, and right. they're adding that lore in. Oh, there okay. you go. Oh, you get graphics on the PlayStation Five then. Oh. Ian, <laughs> <laughs> so shady. It's not much of a difference, though, is it really? I can't I can't tell the difference. <laughs> well, you know when you hope we will be able to tell the difference? When? When you see those texture boxes. Oh yeah, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Percent. Walking through town. Oh, now this is where the textures come in. Yeah. Yes. Show us those, that bloody door. <laughs> yeah, look, that's better. And looking down at the city. Yep, 100%. <gasps> oh, perfect scene to illustrate it with. <laughs> Aww. Walk more nicely, Miss Clyde. Yeah. Um, like, the, the frame rate is noticeable, I will agree with, um, uh, I can't see the comments gone already, but... Yeah, Gavin. It was good. Yeah, it is. The tech, the frame rate's better for sure. The non says they've just added Silent Hill fog everywhere. <laughs> Quality of life. Graphics optimization. Optimization. FPS. Classic. Difficulty. Loading times were quite a lot. Yeah. There you go. It's better. Much speedier. Ooh, okay. Ooh! That's, that's cool. <gasps> More, just most games need to have photo mode. It's just so yeah. cool to have it. Oh game. no! <laughs> yeah, you people thought I thought that People are gonna do terrible yeah. things. Don't mm -hmm. you do it! Not to our lovely yeah. Tatum. Oh. oh my god, she looks so like great. On it. So long. Who are you? She said, like, I'm not your sister, so yeah. maybe they come from the same place. You see that? 
He's from Wutai as well. <laughs> he just looks, he looks too much like yep. Zack. I'm like, why couldn't you have made him not look like Zack? I'm suspicious. Integrate. <laughs> nice. Ooh, that's pretty cool. When do you think they'll be giving us an update about the next episode? Good question. I would hope by the end of this year, but I don't... 6th of the 10th, 21. Is that the 10th of October? June? Yeah, that is that the 10th of June or is that the 6th of Final October? Final Fantasy VII sure. Remake Integrate, say. coming June, to the June PS5 Toba. console later this year. <laughs> Helpful. But yeah, I don't and think we'll hear any. And that's our show. Are you are you're as excited as we are for what's to come in 2021. Really? Really? See you next time. Really? really? What? You get back here right now. Get back, back here right now and get us something else. Cheeky little after something, post credit scene. <sighs> come on. No. Not even a little Kratos oh, going, hello. Okay. Yeah, oh, Kratos. Like Check out the game. I think boy. that is what Kratos sounds like, actually. That is yeah, exactly. Yeah, you'll find Look it. Look at my axe, boy. That was like a little bit underwhelming. Yeah, a little bit. I, um... It just kind of felt like we were told we just weren't even given some stuff. Apart from the Yuffie thing, it just seemed like more stuff that we kind of knew about. Already knew. Yeah. yeah. Like, was there anything like new in the Deathloop news? There was. Oh. Not much, really? right? Really, it was just—it just, was different yeah. gameplay, but that's about just it, I think. More cool, yeah. more, more cool, just more cool. Cool. I don't know. Yeah, yeah I, and I'm a little yeah, bit well, underwhelmed. A little bit that's underwhelmed. What you're left with everyone is just us going. Well, <laughs> but surely, okay. On the silver lining side, this must mean that another state of play is coming that will have info about the stuff we. Yeah, haven't seen yet. I think so, you're like right. God of War and stuff. Yeah, mm. like a, a bumper one that will be like forty-five minutes to an hour long. Yeah, -ish. and I I do really like that there are lots of state of plays at the mm -hmm. moment, or like you know towards the end of last year. It's really nice to kind of just that they are keeping people updated, even if yes. these are sort of smaller updates. Yeah, like it's just it's just good to have that sort of you know this flow of information at least happening. Yeah, I've but... just seen a Faruka in the chat say, "Elden Ring, I'll get you one day." Oh, no. <laughs> oh, oh my god! Yeah. You Maybe said we... like earlier. You said Bloodborne Two is yeah. that was is that ever been teased? Is it? Do you know if it's if that's a thing that may happen? Or... I have heard rumblings that it is a thing that that might happen. Ooh, um, okay. But but no they've never i don't think they've ever confirmed that it's a thing but like oh can you imagine how wonderful it would be if it was yeah. a thing? i i, I did amazing. enjoy bloodborne but um it was a bit like it was only 30 frames per second and after playing the dark souls remaster it just mm. felt a little bit like old and so it'd be nice to have a new smooth yeah. fast <clears throat> there is a 60 yeah. a 60 fps version in the works isn't there or, is there, or something i thought i thought I they someone, were updating it I, some people modded oh. it to run the 60 frames okay but i think you need a modded playstation 4 to be able to do that so. yeah that was just a bit like <sighs> like you know, it, just yeah and nothing you know, no, go for it. <laughs> <laughs> I was just going to say the same as before, like nothing new, just kind of like telling us stuff we already know and like surely giving us longer glimpses at them. But I yeah. think they might have been a little bit misleading in how they described that. Like you could just openly say like this is all, it's not first party games. It's just mm -hmm. like, you know, the majority of the stuff. Yeah, yeah, exactly. But yeah, on the bright side, I guess this means we've got a big bumper PlayStation stream coming at some point, but it's just yeah. kind of like... Okay, I guess cool. they've got to kind of like piece it out for throughout the year because you yeah, know, yeah, a lot of stuff to get through and a lot of stuff will be delayed maybe as well. And even mm -hmm. the the Yuffie news is kind of like it's double it's a double edged uh, you know pointy shuriken for me because like <laughs> I love I, I like seeing her is amazing she looks perfect but like it's it's straying further away from what the original story was and yeah. the original like just Square Enix have a real they have a real history of over complicating things and the fact that they're now adding mm -hmm. um some of the the PSP stuff to it um Crisis Core uh, I'm not sure how I feel about that oh Crisis Core is that mm. the one with the scene you showed me from yes like yeah. ages ago yeah, okay yeah, yeah, yeah. right yeah. interesting yeah also, surely, why don't you just work on the next instalment rather than yeah. doing more like DLCs <laughs> of the first one? Just we'll do the next one. But, yeah. Mm, well. But yeah. 
let's just hope that you know there's going to be another state of play as you say zoe fairly soon yeah i just want more crossed. games just want me more too games. Oh, well, give me just the title, was it? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. 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 Give me new titles or give me updates on like the major bo- major big boys. That's, you know. Yeah. Is that so much to ask? No, I know. I know. Yeah. But I reckon we'll, well see we'll see news from from Resident Evil 8 and stuff before we see yes. first party news, I think. <clears throat> Absolutely. I think that's about right. <sighs> well, I still had fun. It's still yep. it's good to get excited for stuff even if it doesn't come to pass. Yes. Yeah. You know. There you have it, everyone. The yeah. first day of play of 2021. I, I think know. That was. Yeah, I think it was. So hopefully mm-hmm. there'll be lots more to come. And yeah, thanks for joining us all tonight. I just I enjoy getting excited about games with Me you too. guys, even if even if we're getting excited just to have our hopes dashed at the last second. <laughs> or not dashed, postponed. Let's say postponed. Yeah, yeah. that's a good way to put it. <laughs> <laughs> So tomorrow we've uh, we've got a stream coming, and on Saturday I've got a, I'm working on a video that I don't think I can talk about just yet. And then uh, Ian, you've got some VR stuff for us on Sunday. Yeah, might talk about PlayStation VR two or something. Maybe <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. Maybe just a little oh, bit. Yeah. And so you're working on a video for Monday. Yeah, I'm working on a video about the games that help me with my anxiety. Because, yes. Uh, have you noticed lockdown has been a thing and anxiety has been getting worse? <laughs> so I'm showing the games that personally help me with my anxiety. And so. we look forward to hearing about that because I'm sure you're not the only one. Um, and then thank you for the, the super chat, Danny Shields. Uh, I think my super chat was missed. Oh, no, sorry. Uh, Kingdom Hearts style BS confirmed for Final Fantasy VII. Yeah, I think you are <laughs> correct. Oh, Ooh. and we have uh, one more super chat as well from uh, uh, by Struska uh, that says, hello, lovely EG team. It was a bit sad not to see a live yet yesterday as it was my birthday i'm 40 but this more than makes up for it and thanks to Ethan zoe i finally know what my ps fanboy downstairs neighbor is shouting about much love (laughs) oh well happy birthday for yesterday it was a big day sorry we weren't streaming but we we'll make it up to you now and i hope you had a lovely day and we'll be streaming tomorrow so make sure and stop by and say hey then Mm -hmm. because we'll be on a ship being pirates yeah (laughs) (laughs) all right everyone uh we are gonna go to bed because it's quite late but we will Mm -hmm. see you all very soon Uh Bye. Bye. bye